All done. I'm gonna drink some more because it wakes me up and boosts my energy a little bit. And then I get into prayer. And that's really it. I don't do that much. Is gonna get me a smoothie from Baskin Robbins. That was unexpected. Okay. Oh my goodness, why am I so bright? I'm glowing. Good morning. I haven't talked to you all morning long. I'm about to pray and read. I turn on my speaker, I sing and pray to whatever song. Basically, the music I listen to is past services from church. And I know people are asking me for playlists and stuff, but it's like personal from my church that I attend. And so I play those and they're usually like two hours or more long. So I have a lot of time, like it doesn't just run out. And I sing and dance and clap and do whatever the Lord wants me to do just to praise him and get into <laughs> worship mode and excited for the day. Cause that's the best part of the day. This is my prayer corner. Right now, this is my favorite worship to worship to. When I pray, I pray about anything and everything. I want to tell Jesus everything, so I do. I was reading in Ecclesiastes 5 and there's a bunch of things I really liked but I really like this line specifically it is good and comely for one to eat and drink to enjoy the good of all his labor that he takes under the sun all the days of his life which God gives him for it is his portion right here this is the part I like is the part where it says this is the gift of God I wrote my key points and then um, enjoying your life and good times and good moments anyway in conclusion because it's God's gift we should receive it you know gladly like uh yes i'll have fun yes i'll eat and drink and have a good time because that's what i'm about to do that's what's next on my agenda i'm gonna go out there and have brunch my sister just came and got me my smoothie Clean while praising the king. I'm your host, Yodel Jean, 
And today's outfit theme is everyday activity because that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to go to a picnic with my friend Catherine. We're gonna be wearing this Jesus shirt because we have to put on Jesus every single day. Ta -da! I have these orange pants. I don't really wear my color pants. As you can see, this is literally kind of my color palette. So I feel like this would be cute since the shirt on the words are this color. So let's let's give it a try. I don't like this. Ah! Okay, so this is what it does look like. I feel like they're they're modest because they're wide, but they're still a little bit more slim than I like, so I'm gonna just not tuck in the t-shirt. And that's how you make your clothes more modest, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know, I kinda like it. Ah. Lastly, I'm gonna be wearing these shoes. Or I'm gonna try wearing these shoes. Now it's time for my accessories. I got this necklace recently, it says Jesus on it, but it's on a pearl. I love pearls. And then I have this ring. This one I never take off because it's like a promise ring. This is my uh, final outfit. I'm gonna put this on. This is my favorite um, jacket right now. And that's it. Uh-oh, TV. So, I changed my outfit and also I changed my hair clip because I didn't really like the orange that much. At least not with the outfit, I had too much going on. So this is the new outfit. Three, two, one. Ah, I like this much better. Oh, I love you. Let's move this. The blankie? Yeah, because I think they have some light on it. I think they were just attracted to the food, but we can move it. This is Catherine, aka Praise. She moved from Michigan to Georgia because she wanted a healthy church. She dropped everything, her job, people, relationships, etc., to come to my church because she wanted a healthy church. So if you want a healthy church, reach out on Instagram and I'll give you the details. What are you writing on yours? Jesus loves you, welcome. It's not all the way open, but it's kind of just open. I love the feeling of going through my fingers. Oh, did you wait for me, Hadassah? Thank you.